A 93-year-old African-American artist finally gets her first solo show here in Chicago. Faith Ringgold's retrospective received critical acclaim at the New Museum in New York and traveled to San Francisco and Paris before arriving at Chicago's Museum of Contemporary Art. Our Leanne Trotter shares some of the highlights. From quilts to paintings to soft sculptures. The necklaces, the whistles, this beautiful fabric. The breadth of Faith Ringgold's work is quite immense. This retrospective is called Faith Ringgold, American People. Senior curator Jamila James says it's a tongue-in-cheek reference. That the American experience that we talk about or the American dream that's spoken about is not a universal experience. Throughout the 60 years of work featured in the Museum of Contemporary Arts retrospective, you see how Ringgold uses her art as a way to address societal issues and how one can overcome challenges through community and family. Not only is she a practicing artist, a mother and teacher, back in the 1970s, she was also on the front lines of important and difficult conversations. In terms of um, diversity within institutions, um, civil rights, um, working on prison abolition, censorship, the black power movement, the feminist art movement. She really did it all. On Tuesday evening, there'll be a roundtable discussion in this auditorium about the impact of Faith Ringgold's legacy on artists today. Chicago-based artist Amanda Williams will join in the discussion. We'll have a nice range of conversation about um, ways in which her very long and storied career can impact the way artists of our generation can think about approaching the work that they do. And you only have until February 25th to see this monumental retrospective of Faith Ringgold's work. Reporting from Streeterville, Leanne Trotter, NBC5 News.